right here is a match against Shark Teamer from YouTube. And this is a roulette we had quite a while back. I think this is the third one. The first one disconnected. The second one was filled with packs. This one had quite a bit of packs as well. And the first had quite a lot of packs. I think overall with three matches, we had like four, th three sacks as well. It was all random stuff. So this one, um, I get the Noctowl lead, she gets the Discnar lead. I just go for the Nightshade, as I know Discnar doesn't have too high HP, so getting 100 damage off will be quite useful, but he has Thunder Punch, and that does about 50%. So I go for the Roost now, just so he get healed up if he went for Thunder Punch again, it'll do about half what he already did, so he'll have 75 HP or so left. But he says his Darcy Ring, no one if I went for the attack, it's nothing I could do anyway. So he over predicted there, went for the Earthquake, I thought I'd maybe I'd love an attack, a Roost, but I don't, he takes me out one hit, so I can't try and stall him and maybe get a little more poison damage on him. So I go to Licky Licky now, I predict the switch to this one so I go for the Earthquake. This is a choice banded Licky Licky, so yeah, I actually didn't do as much as I hoped for with the Earthquake, and yeah. So I decided to switch the camera up now, thinking it'll go for the Pain Slit, and I got a really bad team for the Roulette. Well, in that, a lot of my things have really high HP, so um, I need to get something low HP, well, low high HP, if that makes sense, for the Snorri Pain Slit. So he goes to King now uh, Yawn, he switches out to Dragonite, and I switch to Lapras, and just predicting moves there, and he switches out with a Slippier and Ice Beam, and I got crit. I get a freeze, and yeah, that was just pretty random there. I think this one, he actually breaks out first turn. Yeah, he breaks out, and he gets a thunder punch off. So that was pretty lucky. So yeah. Um, I'm pr not sure I may or may have not been able to take him out with the surf, so I don't want to chance it, and I switched the camera up to take the pain split. Um, as if he lived, a pain split would have done quite a lot to that press. So, he goes for the Shadow Sneak now, I think I go for the Earth Power, thinking he may go to Kingdra again, I'm not sure, but he doesn't, and Earth Power didn't really do too much. So I think I go for the Yawn next, um, just to try to get this in our sleep, as the pain was really bothersome. I do get the Yawn off, and I think I switch to Licky Licky here to take the Shadow Sneak if he goes for it. If he switches, that's even better. But he goes for Shadow Sneak, and he's obviously got all sleep now. So... Yeah, that's very good. And this match is going way too fast for me. Um, but yeah, so I'll go back to the camera now, just really to try to get more leftovers, as he's pretty much dead at the moment. So I go for Lava Plume. Um, think I don't, I can't remember the base power, Lava Plume and Earth Power. See what one's stronger. But yeah, I go for Lava Plume again. He goes to King Jot. I get Crat. I get Burn. So yeah, it's not too bad for him as he's a special King Jot. But the fact that he has Life Orb that makes things even worse. So I predicted he'll predict the switch and go for something like a Dragon Pulse or a non-attacking move, but to my disappointment, the Dragon Pulse actually still takes me out. So I go to Licky Licky again, I Earthquake, I take out, no I don't take him out, I almost take him out, he lives with like 1 HP and then I'm able to take him out the next turn of the Earthquake, so yeah, that's pretty good. I think he was suspecting me to be bandied, so he brings in Dragonite, and me switching out obviously shows off that I am bandied, otherwise I could have stayed in and went for the return and or explosion. So I've got Slowbro while Drag dances, he goes for the Outrage, which isn't too good for me, but Slowbro's actually able to love that, with 72 HP, get the Ice Beam off, and take out the Dragonite. And he actually got pretty lucky in this roulette, that he got quite a lot of overuse, I got more underuse, and... I think mostly underused, can't remember if I got any overuse. But he goes to Earth Ring, which actually firms when he's underused, so that's quite good. And goes for the facade, takes Slowbro out. I go to Lucky Lucky now, I go for the return, and I get a crit here against the Weezing, which is really good for me and bad for him. So here I was thinking I should be able to take it out with another return, but I never actually thought about if he would outspeed me or not. So he obviously outspeeds, gets the pain split, and that's good for him. And there's nothing here I want to switch to. I have Harry Yama, which I can switch to, which you can't do anything amazing. I have Lapras, but I don't want to take um, B lower HP. But I think I probably should have been better to switch into Lapras to surf it and take him out. Um, overall, I think that would have been better. Um, as Lucky Lucky at fuller HP would have been able to love this facade and just um, return and finish off the Ursa Ring. So I've got Harry Yama now. Um, I go for the first palm and I get the power hacks on the Jirachi. And yeah. And funny enough, probably the only thing that mainly should have got the hacks was this Jirachi, but I never actually got power hacks or everything else on his team. Seemed to get a million times hacks against it, 
I don't think Zephyrin uh, got any hacks against it, so that's quite good. So he almost takes another Psychic, I was really surprised to love that, but yeah, go for the second first palm, it's not enough to take him out, and he takes the AM out, so I'm down in the last guy, Lapras, and I go for the Surf and take the Jirachi off, obviously, as I'm faster, because of me getting the Paralyze. So he goes to Ursa Ring now, and... Yeah, I'm actually quite surprised Lapras was able to love that so well. I thought he would have done quite a lot more than he did. But, oh yeah, I got crit there, so the Ring does get hacks. I was wrong. Um, so yeah, being King join here, I thought I would actually love the Drown Pulse, but I don't. It takes me out, and yeah, that's a good game. It's actually been quite funny, and then if um, I was able to live, I spinned him back. He lived, he took me out next turn, Life Arb took him out, so it was a draw. That'd been quite funny, but never happened. So, good game there, Tamer. Rate, comment, subscribe. Thanks for watching, and also check out his channel, which will be in the sidebar.